I was doing my piece up just like uh, every single weekend and uh, the 11 was right behind me, the 21 was in front of me. So uh, unfortunately I got boxing, as we know, every single time that we do piece ups, we drop a little bit of fuel, that's completely normal. Uh, unfortunately, when the 11 was leaving, he stopped right behind me because he was waiting for me to leave and his exhaust fired up the little fuel I dropped. And since I was still parked there, that grabbed into, my, into the back of my car where the fuel cell is and it just grabbed, I mean, very, very, very unfortunate situ situation, to be honest. Uh, I don't know, honestly, I don't know what we could have done different, but uh, just a little bit sad that uh, that we were out of the race this way so early, but uh, I'm glad I'm fine and, and the entire team was fine. And the, other, the other crazy thing is that I was able to feel the heat, but because I don't run a rear view mirror, I only run the rear view camera, I couldn't see it. The rear view camera, as you guys know, is connected in the rear bumper, so I can see the smoke, but I cannot see the fire, so I can feel the heat, but I couldn't see how big it was. And they you wanted to stay in because we knew once you got out, you'd be out of the race. I, I wanted to stay in because I thought we were going to be able to shut it off, but the second I stopped, I thought oh, the car was on fire, so I knew we were not going to shut it off. What was the sensation other than... One second. What was the sensation other than heat? They say the driver's biggest fear is fire. I was fine. Honestly, I wanted to keep running. I was hoping that we were going to be able to shut it off, but when I, when I, when I was running in the car, I can feel the heat and I can feel, I can see the smoke, but I cannot see the fire. The second I stop, it's almost like the fire catches on you and, and I saw the half of the car was on fire. So at that point I knew we were not going to be able to 